Everybody's very excited about what everybody else is doing. You know, like, uh, looking around at what these guys are making, I'm very impressed. And there's a lot of quality stuff going on here. There's a lot of good ideas, and um, we're going to bring some. In, so a lot of us are going to bring something into this industry that's going to change things. Very small brands with uh, 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 craftsmen, you know, doing their products in uh, in very small. Uh, uh, workshops and uh, that's very nice. I, I like very much that. You know, it's it's something different, fresh, with passion, and it's it's really good for the industry to have to have guys with passion in it. And that's actually the great thing about SIA. It, this whole thing is just burgeoning with wonderful ideas for the next year. Then you constantly have those companies, like all these craft companies, coming up with their new ideas. And there is an element of sharing, which is really great. Because of that, you know, we have different viewpoints than you see a lot of times. There's not a lot of us, you know, there's, you know, it's a small handful. And we can really kind of cater our product towards, you know, a regional skier. We are a, you know, a completely a family operation. My mother's actually our office manager. My father, who is a carpenter, runs our wood shop. I design skis. I can't say enough how great it is to work with our family and uh, you know have that relationship. You know, the years go on, a lot of the technology is coming and boiling up from these creative think tank small companies and we actually are proud to be uh, one of those companies. We actually use aerospace technology, uh, vacuum molding, which is pretty rare in the industry. So a lot of people are a little skeptical of our design here, but we actually moved our edge from up here all the way down to the contact point and uh, this has allowed us, we'd never have uh, edge blowout like to the side anymore. And it, this kind of seems like a ridiculous issue to have, but park skis just take such a beating uh, that we've just put a lot of precedent on keeping them together. So this is by far the most durable ski we've ever built. <laughs> I wanted to have boards with much more performance, whatever the snow conditions, and also those surf feelings. And we also bring those very intuitive, fluid, aquatic feelings with the skis. At the beginning, it was like if I was on a not a UFO, even in another galaxy. But it's working. It's working. So we're sitting down one day, uh, and my mom called and left a voicemail and said, hey, Marhars, have you guys come up with an idea yet? When she left us that voicemail, we said, that's it. That's the name we're going with. The brain never stops. You know, even if something rides awesome, I'm like, well, how can I make it even better? The fact that we manufacture in-house, if we have an idea, we can, we can press a board on the fly in one day and go out and ride it the next day and decide if we like it, or if the shape came out right, or if the side cut's right. Our main focus was not just to try to jump into, well, we got to get boards in Colorado, we got to get boards in Montana, Utah. We said, let's, let's just focus on our local area. Let's show Michigan that there's a quality Michigan snowboard company right here in their backyard. You know, to be able to support the local economy, get American-made materials and bring some manufacturing back, you know, from China onshore is great for us.